Hello, all. Welcome. Welcome to Stock Finance. This is Bravo here. How are you guys doing? Great. Market had a big, big surprises, right? Market gave a big surprises and uh, opened the gap down, right? Opened the gap down. And what happened after opening gap down? Now, after opening gap down, let's see uh, what is the stance, what we had today. Right? Okay, now let's discuss what's happening. Today, market opened at the levels of 10,350 and it sharply bounced back up 10,413. Then again, it took over a hit again back at 10,350 itself. At the second candle, at the 935, right? At 935, we announced to go long on 10,340. With the stop loss of 10,330, just to keeping the stop loss of 10 points, we gave a long entry on index. Right? We gave a long entry on index. See, the, the, the stop loss, what we kept is only just 10 points. So imagine keeping a stop loss of 10 points for a 10,500 index. Right? It is not an easy call. The call was very, very uh, calculative, calculated, and uh, uh, we knew that it might not go down further. If it goes down further, it will crash further. So clearly, I told in the morning that go long on index at 10,340 with the stop loss of 330. Initiate short below 330 with the stop loss of 340. At the both sides, I gave a long short loss target with just 10 points of the scheme. For the future lot itself, I said clearly by the future lot. Now it's executed. We asked them to keep an open position with 10 point stop loss. The target does uh, with a target of first target is 400. So the first target was itself as 60 points up. So the index starts straight traveling without looking up backside up to 10,400. At that time, we said. Uh, uh, we were, before that, we also gave a looping call today with uh, 8 12 entry, the stop loss of 8 9. We booked a trading stop loss of one point. We asked, we said, I clearly said it will go up non stop. Looping close today at the price of what price 836. It touched 840 as well from 809. When it was here, this candle made a low of 811. I mean, this candle 811 and it bounced back. It was, I think, this candle. This candle made a low of 811 and bounced back. Our target stop mm. loss was trailing stop loss was hit. Still, I told you it will travel. It traveled non stop to 840 levels. Leave about that. Let's come back to Nifty again. Okay. And after entering at these levels, whatever will be given, we clearly said first target is 10,400. It next made a high of 10.5. Now further upside move, Nifty will move the further up to second target of, uh, what was second target? 420. So after second target of 420, index will turn into bullish mode with the next target of 450. So after it touched first target of 1,400, it touched next target of 10,420, right? 420, it traveled straight to the next target of 10,500. Then, mm -hmm. again, we clearly said that uh, once, once the 10,500 was hit, the next target is four, uh, 420, it hit, right? Next is 450, it went and hit 450 also. I mean, 500. Uh, 450 done. That is what the target, what we just mark. And after that, we said 450 is also hit. It was somewhere here. The next target was 450. 450 also hit. After hitting 450, the next is 481 and 502. So 481 was. Right here. 481. It went 500 and finally we said the final target for the index is Nifty will become 530, post which super bullish, right? It went touch 530 and finally we said book all the profits 
at 10,530, close all your calls. So I'm very posted that. Good support and gonna find option G and look at index above 550. We can above close this, we can book a good amount of experts, good amount of movement because it made a solid Mara Buzu candle. And also mentioned to book complete profit 500, 550 levels. I'm just looking into weather in a siege. Let me check. Uh, it's 10,550 levels. Okay. Book your final profit at 550 levels at 130 itself. I alerted to book and exit. It taking close 557 and above. Now, what is the so importance of this level 550? Because if you look at the daily charts, Nifty has made a solid, solid Marabuzu candle. Uh, a small upper wick is there, made a good Marabuzu candle. Now let us draw the Fibonacci series and check what's happening. So we knew that we have drawn this Fibonacci series last week also when I was in live class. Right? Today, look at here. It, it again going to cross 38.2% retracement level. Now the next small hurdle or biggest hurdle what I could see is 10,000. The low of this, it is 10,588 or 590. So if 10,590 is crossed, we can expect good bull run up to 10,900 levels. That is non-stop. If it takes a hit from here, again, it will fall back to these levels. That's on the nifty one. So, and it again today also we crossed a profit of about 10,000 rupees. Uh, overall, we booked around 15,000 rupees in Nifty alone. Nifty alone. So, not only this, we have booked many amount of such kind of profits in the group. In the group, we have we had a good good uh, experts who booked a good amount of profit in PFC, right? PFC people have booked it, and uh, one more guy has booked in PFC Lupin. We had a loop in this day carry forward the loop in and uh, batch eight, the latest batch. It's ongoing on as usual uh, to start booking profits. But we had a good amount of profits. People booked Apollo Hospital 3500. And those gentlemen had a good profit of uh, four, six plus four tens or 18,000 rupees in different stocks. People keep booking profits. We didn't post that sort, but people keep booking profits. Now, the couple of stocks what we had in our positional stocks. Were a couple of stocks like we had Sun Pharma, a positional holding, it had a good breakout today. And we also had Exaware, had a good 5% breakout. All was a positional future holding, which you have taken last month. Couple were went down because of gap down openings. And I also give Biocon morning for two points of stop loss, right? Mm -hmm. Also give morning for two points of stop loss. Wow. Right? See, this was a move I expect on Biocon. Let me look at the Biocon call, what we've given. Uh, we gave two point stop loss hit. Uh, oh, today, today, let me check. Six sixteen, the stop loss is fourteen. So our level, what I've given was six sixteen with the stop loss of six hundred fourteen. Why I gave us such a small stop loss? Because I don't want to lose huge money because of huge volatility in the market. So uh, entry was around. 616, right? 616, stop loss of 614. So this candle hit a stop loss and we exited with two things, right? Uh, exited two things and uh, here it went non-stop up to, up to, 634, a good amount of profits in Biocon. Also, of course, we didn't monitor and exit it. We could have booked it, right? So apart from that, oh, we had a good calls today, good in the market today as well. So we will have upcoming videos, such kind of videos in upcoming days as well. So before I can wind off, all the seminars has been mm. planned for respective cities. So please do plan for your respective uh, uh, cities and block your seats. We'll meet you there at your respective locations very soon. Bye guys, thanks for your time. Have a nice evening ahead. We'll have some kind of videos for tomorrow as well. Mm -hmm.